Grace Repair Zone, thanks for stopping in. I'm going to give you a little tip here how to clean these green corroded wires. I have to solder the end on because it was broken. Uh, barely, barely hanging on. Now, I take muriatic acid. Uh, basically, it's hydrochloric acid. You don't breathe this stuff in though, the fumes aren't very good. And what I'll pour a little bit in a cap so you're not wasting a whole bunch. This jug actually lasts me a long, long time. Now you don't want to breathe that stuff because it's not good for your lungs. Now you see how green and gross that is? I'm just going to dip it in here. I don't know if you could see it work. Dip it in there a little bit and uh, let it sit. Now it's cleaning it all off so I could actually solder a new end on it. You have to uh, rinse this off in water after so it doesn't stay on the wire. And there you can see how I'm going to focus on me here. Let's see how much better it is now. I guess I should have took a before and after picture and put a still on there, but now that thing, put a little bit of uh, solder paste on it after I rinse it off with water. And solder it up. Little bit of soap and water. I'm gonna soak it in there for a bit. Kind of dilutes the uh, hydrochloric acid or mur muriatic acid. You can see inside that cap, it's kind of. Swirling around, I don't know. It'll clean that all up nicely. Just gonna soak it in there for a little while and it'll be good to go. And be careful. Uh, you should be wearing gloves. I don't because I've been doing it for so long. I, I know what to watch out for. Uh, don't wanna get careless with it because it's quite caustic. It will burn your hands and skin. And once you heat this up to solder on your new connector, all that water evaporates, it's gone, so. There. From a corroded piece of crap to uh, Good new clean copper wire. All right, I got the new end, well, the old end on. I cleaned it up. I'm gonna solder it on. Now this here bottle is the one I filled up last winter. I don't know if, uh, if you haven't seen the video, go check on my uh, on my video how to refill these small propane bottles. So this one here has lasted me all summer and uh, really didn't cost me much at all, just my time. So I'm gonna solder this up here quickly. I'll put some uh, 
some acid paste on the on the wire. And there you go. And it's not as nice as I want it, so I'm gonna give it a little bit more. There. Now that's how she's done. Thanks for watching again. And we'll see you again.